And it's a particularly windy night, too, with this drive going into the wind, making it a little bit less conducive for passing. Another first down carry. The ball comes loose at the end of the run, and the Aggies say they've come up with it. There are many layers of this pile to be peeled away to determine who fell on top of the loose ball. Utah State football. Have the ball in that crowd at the end. You got to make sure you cover it up with two hands. He's trying to, but it just seems like at the end. Ball is loose. And Utah State first team to fall on top of it. Gerard Sanders had it, and it just squirted out of his hands. Stay at home. You wait for something to come your way. Anderson right there just making a play. So back to it for Jordan Love. And they set up the screen. This will be their biggest burst of the night here for Jalen Warren across midfield. They're going to get their chance to run their first play in Air Force territory. And that's a big play. Yeah, that, that goes down as huge. You're only down a couple scores. Watch here in the slot. If I'm Jordan Love, finding Tompkins. Pressure comes. He throws into single coverage to the corner of the end zone. Touchdown, Utah State, as he hits the OC Mariner for his third touchdown of the year. And finally, the Aggies are on the board. Who gets one on one on the outside. And this is where Jordan Love, so many people fall in love with him at the quarterback position. It throws like this, throwing it to the wide. He's covered. CLC Mariners covered the long day for these cadets. Always admire that about them. Passing situation, and the ball comes loose as Hammond got hit from behind as he let it go. Nick Henninger laid the hit on him, and the ball goes laterally, tumbling out of bounds. Yeah, that ball went backwards. That was, a, that was a, just a nice play and an outstanding rush. Okay, you get up to get the rush. That's what you want. But I think the bigger thing is there was nobody open on the outside, right? There was nobody open. And therefore, snowed and blood in the water. Hammond hands it off. Rumsburg is tripped up. Shaq Bond, the junior who had an interception last week, play quickly to an end. I love alley players, right? Shaq Bond's an alley player. He just runs the alley. Long wind, and when the sun went down, it got a lot colder tonight. Yeah, the wind is what's making it so cold down here. Now, luckily for the players, they have these heaters on the sidelines, so you can see them all gather around those heaters, and I think that helps significantly.